can let our own personal agendas get in the way. Good intended, but it may not be God intended. And a lot of the time it's it's fear that creates the resistance. Fear to the unknown, um, fear to change, fear to doing things um, the way we haven't done it before. And I don't know how to do that because I don't know how to do that and I don't want anything to do with it. Um, when really that's where God's probably doing God's work is in the midst of that. And, and, and our invitation to the yes is, is before saying yes, um, our invitation is to step into the midst of that and be okay. You begin to see an openness to conversation um, and exploring is asking questions looking for solution, to work towards um, what's going to be best for the common good and, and realizing that my solution may not be the right solution, but somewhere in the midst there is. And, and I think that's humility. Um, I think there's a humbleness about that. Um, I think there's a sense of excitement about it. You can sense it in someone who's really beginning to feel that. Um, empowerment and it, and I think when the Holy Spirit is active in, a, in an individual sense um, others others are drawn to that person a no to me is a closed fist and so um, so it, it's reflecting that fight mentality I'm gonna protect myself I'm taking a stance for what I believe in you know, it's a defiance. Um, one cannot even begin to receive until someone lets go. And so um, there's that there's that sense of having to kind of let go of self and um, and just begin to trust. And that's a whole lot hard. It's easy to say, a lot harder to do. Trust in God, but tether your camel. You know, don't, don't put God to the test and just say, okay, if you're out there and you want me to do this, then you need to be obedient to, you need to listen to, you need to be faithful to. Um, but at the same time, you can't, you can't be in control or total control because you're not. God is. Don't rush the process. Be very intentional about taking time and making time to just be in prayer study together, to pray together, um, put the agenda aside for a little while and just, you know, be open and accepting and receiving of, of one another.